Hey guys, for all the details on this blunt cut bob from Love Me Hair, keep watching. My rules, big moves. Y'all heavy on the tweeting. I disappear a whole season like, who said they looking for me? I'm gonna make you pay for it. Spend a few racks on a shopping spree. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Stephanie. If you are new here, welcome. I am back with another Love Me Hair unit. So this is the unit that we are reviewing today. This short and sassy blunt cut bob. I am super excited to try this one on for you all. But before we do, if you are new to my channel, please do me a huge favor. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as that notification bell and set it to all so you do not miss a thing on my channel. So how this video is going to work, I am going to show you my unboxing of this unit all the goodies that came along with it let me hear included some new goodies this time so I'm excited to show you that um, and then I am going to show you with this unit um, and then I am going to show you me flat ironing this unit because it did have you know the shape of the box on the unit and you'll know what I mean in just a moment um, but I did have to run the flat iron over it just a little bit um, and then I'm going to come back and install this unit so you know what to do. Keep watching. All right, guys, let's go ahead and open up this box. Inside the box is a quote from Love Me Hair's customer. Confidence in yourself shines through every time and the only person you have to compete with is yourself. All right. So also in the box, of course, is the unit. I'll show you that in just a moment. Also, we got some new goodies. So this mini flat iron, super duper cute. It's purple and it says love me hair on it. If you decide to do baby hairs, I know some of the girls are doing that with the mini flat irons. So also in the box is an edge brush. Also this mesh bag that says love me hair to store the unit. Also this leopard print elastic bands with the Velcro on the back if you do decide to melt your unit. Also the silicone headband, a pack of wig caps and a user guide to show how to care for the hair in their return policy. So now let's go ahead and take a look at the unit. So I'm just taking the mesh netting off as well as the paper so we can get a better look. So this is HD lace. It is a left side part, so it has lace right there at the front of the unit as well as in that parting line. And this is a C-shaped part. So two comes in the front, one in the back, also the adjustable straps and elastic bands, and that elastic band is adjustable. This unit is eight inches long and the color is natural black. So here is the unit just straight out of the box. So as you can see, I'm going to need to do a little bit of work to it. So I decided to pluck the hairline just a little bit. So I'm clipping the hair out of the way, only leaving a sliver of hair out. And I'm taking my lady tweezers to pluck the hair. And I'm just plucking sporadic hairs around this area just to thin out the hairline just a little bit. Even though this is like a T-part unit, you still have enough lace right there in the front if you did want to pluck it out as I am doing. Now I'm combing the hairs back that I left out and again clipping the hair out of the way, taking my lady tweezers and just tweezing out just a little bit more. And I'm gonna do the same exact thing on the other side. And keep in mind, this unit can only be worn as a left side part. So I just wanna make note of that so that you all know. And now it's time to style this unit up. So I'm just taking layers of hair, small sections, and using my flat iron to put a small bend in it. We do not want a church bump. We just want a slight bend. I'm concentrating on the size of the unit. The back was pretty much okay, just straight out of the box. But the size of the unit needed a little bit of TLC since they were bent in the box during shipping. As I'm working my way up the hair, you can really see the style of this unit. How is this asymmetrical blunt cut bob? It's so pretty. This is sure to be a sleek, edgy look. I absolutely love it. I'm gonna finish styling up this unit and then I'm gonna come back to go ahead and provide you with all the specs on this unit, everything that you need to know. All 
All right, guys, I am back. Time to install this unit. So let me go ahead and provide you with all the specs of this unit as well. So this is Love Me Here's Put On and Go Blood Cut Straight Minimalist HD Lace Bob. And this unit is kind of like a T-part unit, has lace right here along the front of the hairline and then lace right here in the parting line. And this is a left side part. So sorry to you right side part girls, this is a left side part unit. It can only be a left side part. Um, this unit is eight inches long. It is um, $149.90, so around $150. But you know, I have you covered with a promo code, which is SNH25, which gets you 25% off. It's 100% human hair. It is 150% density, medium cap size, and the knots are pre-bleached. I did pluck the hairline though, just a little bit. So I'm gonna go ahead and first start by putting on the elastic band, and the elastic band is adjustable. So I'm just gonna put that around the back of my head. As so and then I saw that back comb in the back of my hair already I can tell that this unit oh never mind fits my head it does fit my head okay so this is what we are looking like so far um, here is that hairline so I am going to push my wig cap just a, back a little bit. And since my hair is braided underneath here, I'm not going to install those front combs, but I am going to go ahead and cut off the lace off the front of this unit. Um, and I'm going to use my pinking shears, has those zigzag cuts there. And I'm just going to cut straight across the lace. So as close to the hairline as possible. Usually I do this on my mannequin head, but I forgot to do that. So I'm just gonna do it now. I'm trying not to cut these little flyaways here in the front. Let me move my clip over to this side now. I promise you all, cutting the lace off is so much easier when you just have it on the mannequin head. Cutting lace on my head is just blah. <laughs> so here we are. And you can see my wig cap just a little bit. Okay, so let's cut that just a little bit more. I'm just gonna use the regular shears. So now that we have the lace cut off, um, I'm gonna use my hot comb to kind of get these flyaways out of the way. So here's my flat iron, and I'm just going to comb back. Comb back, that's it. So I'm going to try something just a little different today. I'm gonna to use some of my Lotta Body, which I normally use just on my curly units, but I'm gonna just put a little bit right here around that lace. going to take this elastic band that Love Me Hair provided with the Velcro on the back and I'm just going to tie it down. 
and I'm just going to let it dry for about five, 10 minutes and then I'm gonna come right back. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and take off this elastic band. And this just helps the lace to just melt just a little bit. Um, we are not gluing anything down or um, spraying anything down. But I am going to put a little bit of powder right here in the parting line and around the hairline. So right here specifically, in between that um, weed cap and my actual and I'm just going to put the lace right here in the front. Okay, so this here, I'm just going to clip that just a little bit so it's more even. And pull at the bottom. Okay. All right, but this is what we are looking like. I'm going to turn around so I can show you all angles. So side, as you can see, it's kind of like that asymmetrical bob angling towards the front. Hands back, short and sassy. Side and front. Okay, let's get into the pros and cons of this unit. So pro number one for me is the shape of this unit. I love, love, love a blood cut bob. And this one is absolutely gorgeous. The length is absolutely perfect. Eight inches is just hitting like the bottom of my chin. I love that. So if you've been following my channel for a while, you know that my actual hair was cut in this exact shape. So that's why I'm pretty much just gushing over this. Um, right now I'm kind of transitioning my own hair back to natural. So it's all over the place under this unit. And this is giving me some nostalgia. It's kind of making me think of my own bob when it was cut in this shape. So absolutely love that. Um, this is a silky texture. So just want to let you know that it is not a yakky texture or a kinky straight texture. It is silky straight. So, and then, um, the convenience of this unit, it is pretty much a throw on and go unit. Um, I did have to just run the flat iron over it just a little bit. I did try to melt the lace just a little bit, but that was just an optional step. And um, 150% density. So it's enough hair on this unit. It's affordable, only $150. Um, I just love the length of it, the shape of it, the cut of it. I love that it's already cut in this beautiful shape and style. So pretty much just out of the box ready to wear. You don't have to cut it. You don't have to really style it, style it. Just running a flat iron over it just takes no time whatsoever. Um, just a little bit of powder right there in the party line and you are good to go. Um, the cap size, medium cap size, is fitting my head very, very well. The ear taps fall exactly where I need them to fall, which is usually hit or miss with me, but this one is hitting. Um, what else can I say about this unit? There was a little bit of shedding, and that was only because I was cutting off the lace right here in front of you instead of on my mannequin head, which I normally typically like to do. Um, so I can't really say there's any negatives on this unit. The knots already come bleached for you. This is very much so beginner friendly and it's a look. This is my style, this is my jam, this is my cup of tea, this style here. I absolutely love it. Usually I go for the curly units, um, but this, this is what I have been looking for. I have been searching for the perfect blunt cut bob and this one, I have found it. It fits my head, it's the perfect length. I don't have to do anything to it. Yes, this is it. This is it, this is her, I love it. Um, 
no real negatives on this unit that I can really think of. It's 100% human hair. So if you did want to dye it lighter or dye it jet black, which I might, um, you're more than welcome to do so. You can wash it, you can curl it, all of that good stuff. Um, yeah, I'm not really seeing any negatives on this unit. I'm not really seeing any. Make sure to get your hands on this unit, especially if you're a left side part girl. Even if you are a right side part girl, um, we're converting you. Come on over. Come on over to the left side part gang here. Um, but that's it for this review. Make sure to check out my description box. I'm gonna put a link to Love Me Hair's website, a link to this short sassy unit. Um, also, my promo code is SNH25. Don't forget that. Jot it down. 25% off any units at Love Me Hair. Um, like, comment, subscribe. And as always, I'll see you all next time.